His father and grandfather were teachers. His other grandfather was an engineer. But Dr. Jonathan Fannin's teaching style and philosophy came from someone else, someone named Einstein. Early in my career, I uh, ran across a quote by Albert Einstein, and it just, it just caught everything I wanted to put across. The value of an education is not the learning of many facts, but the training of the mind to think of something that cannot be learned from textbooks. I'll share with you the enthusiasm for the topic, I'll share with you why it's important, and then I'm going to challenge you to go out and learn that material within the context that I described for its application. Entertaining, stimulating, and challenging, his rapport with his students is remarkable, and one of the many reasons the Belfast native has won UBC's Killam Teaching Prize twice in forestry and applied science. Good teaching requires constant attention and effort. You need to put yourself in the mind of what do they want to get out of that particular class and how are you going to make sure the message gets across. Okay, so you prepared it in the deflocculating agent? It's hard work, it's preparation. But when you get it right, it sure pays off. The PhD from Oxford has supervised more than 20 PhD and master's students and has coordinated and reorganized classroom and lab courses in soil mechanics, road construction, and slope stability. It's a chance that this isn't a, such a free-flowing in terms of cross-permeability. It's not often that the father of three can find time away from parenting or teaching to pursue his hobby of oil painting. I stop thinking about engineering when I'm painting, and that's about the only time I do stop thinking about engineering. It, for me, it's relaxation and nothing more, nothing less. There's seldom any wasted time in his life. Even commuting has become part of his own version of a triathlon. And I find that combination of running and biking and swimming just makes sure that work and life remain in a nice balance and healthy body, healthy mind. For his excellence in the classroom and the lab, and educating and invigorating new generations of engineering students, Dr. Jonathan Fannin is a deserving recipient of APEG-BC's Teaching Award. <laughs>